Howdy champs, my name is Mohitin guys, uh, today I'm gonna show you how to create a mini mp3 player a new improved mini mp3 player guys, uh, a music player that is I actually uh, done a tutorial yesterday that showed you how to create a mp3 player now this one is a, a little improved, it's, uh, you know it has the volume control by which I mean you can actually use the slider to increase and decrease the volume uh, guys let me open up the music folder which contains all the assets and uh, let me show you what exactly uh, do I mean by uh, whatever I'm saying guys this is the resultant swift file uh, let me play it for you all right now this is the uh, player now uh, I'm not very good with aesthetics I don't have a very good uh, designer sense I'm more of a developer who can actually code a lot uh, as I said, I don't uh, have very good uh, aesthetic sense. So, uh, but but it's, it's very effective, guys. Uh, see, out here, the mute and the stop buttons are actually disabled. We have a volume slider which has been set to uh, one right now. The volume is always between zero and one. One is the maximum, guys. This is the play button, and the moment I hit the play button, guys, the label will change to next, and the mute and the stop buttons will get enabled. And uh, then you can see what happens later on. Let me just first hit the play button. Next, next, mute, unmute, stop, play, use the, you know, the, the volume slider, next, mute, stop, right, so guys, as you can see, all the, uh, buttons and this volume slider are working to perfection okay so uh, guys what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna give away this project now the good thing about this project is that all the files all the mp3 files are actually located externally there are actually three of them this is the first one this is the second one this is the third one okay no matter how many uh, mp3 files you have you know uh, this you just need to make a slight uh, modification to the script okay uh, just one line of modification and the uh, action script just uh, works just as fine right so that's that's the best part so basically the sounds are being pulled out as an external asset guys okay let me open up the flower file this is the flower file guys right there you go so that is the uh, flower file and um, let me open up the access panel for you guys now guys as you can have a look out here that uh, <laughs> the this is uh, probably in fact this is the first uh, script that is more than hundred uh, lines that I've written it exceeds uh, more than hundred lines although there are a few blank lines here and there but yet it's it, it exceeds uh, the limit of 100 uh, lines uh, I'm actually fond of writing short and uh, effective scripts it, it's effective although although it's quite effective it's a little longer that's that's because guys we are actually controlling the the we're using the sound class which is a little complex all right i've actually done uh, the button formatting out here you see the button component that the buttons that you pull out from the button you know, button components in flash actually smaller in size uh, but i've done the button formatting out here as well all right so guys um, you see it's it's a complex script it took me around three days to write this I, I worked around three to four hours every day to make this you see uh, if a person understands the sound class the arrays uh, you shouldn't find uh, it difficult to understand the script okay I'm actually not uh, gonna go take you into the details of how the script actually fires this is available as a free download from my website guys which is http colon forward slash forward slash quality lessons dot net you can grab it from there guys um, if you you are pretty okay with action script uh, you should be able to understand the script the hard part, the part is something that I've already done I've already uh, spent around 10 to 12 hours working on this script and uh, making it work the way it does right now alright guys so um, this uh, 100 lines plus of action script is available as a free download and you can uh, use it on uh, you know on your projects It'd be nice if you can credit me by just taking my name somewhere in some capacity right so that's it guys i think uh, this isn't uh, in the true sense a real tutorial tutorial it's basically just a giveaway guys uh, 
I don't think I have the uh, you know inclination and the, the stamina to actually explain each and every line especially when the script is so big so just take it and use it guys all right so uh, guys uh, I hope to see you uh, very soon uh, with yet another flash and action 3 tutorial you have a good day bye bye peace